hello angels welcome back to another diy video we're gonna be making another resin clutch i think this is gonna be our third one i'm not sure where we are at with these clutches but clutches the clutch is from amazon the vinyls at seas i will leave the link down in the description box i can't find the exact one that i got but i found the seller that i ordered from so i'm just gonna leave that down in the description dry press flowers amazon of course first step first thing first we cut out the vinyl i kind of messed up on this part i wanted the other two the top part right there where she's just posing and the stars around her but i had to reflect his side up so that's why i couldn't see where i was cutting but it's completely fine i can just make another one and use the exact same one that i wanted and i'm gonna be cutting out three of them one for the front one for the back something cute and yeah i cut it out and i cut off all of the extra pieces of it and yeah i just place it inside to see how it would look looks adorable love it okay let's get started i mixed up some resin i'm just pouring down a thin layer so that i'll be able to add on in there the resin foil sheets and the flowers make sure you get all around in the clutch so that there's no space you just place down in there the vinyl and push it all the way down to get all of the bubbles out and if there's bubbles popping up just get your lighter and just blow it out quick and easy bam, bam, bam. i should add some glitter I already add glitter on a different one. Hmm. I don't know. Now I'm just placing out in there the flowers. Just randomly. You don't have to use flowers. You can just do whatever you want. But obviously this is how I'm doing it. Kitty, kitty, yeah, yeah. It is so hot. I can't turn on the fan. Also, when I was placing on the phones, obviously there were some bubbles that was forming, so I just used my lighter again to get rid of them really quickly. I obviously don't want no bubbles because you could see it straight through the bag, and that would definitely not be cute. And we're going to be doing the exact same thing to the other side. By the way, you have to wait 24 hours for it to be fully dry before you can flip it over. I think that's the case with all resin, either 24 or 48 hours just to be safe Okay, after this layer dry, I decided to add, I mixed two different types of blue and some glitter and I just pour it down. Obviously, wait another 24 Welcome hours for it to dry. Back. So, I made this. Obviously, you guys saw the whole process. I asked on my Instagram, not my Instagram, my TikTok, if I should leave it as this or do the same thing to the other side. Only one person voted, so let's go with that. Look at how gorgeous it is. You guys already know, remove the plastic. I keep it passing on just in case the resin doesn't get on top of it. 
Hopefully you guys can hear me because for some reason I'm talking low. This part has some space, so I need to add some resin in there. How can I miss that? But let's add on the shade. Outside feels absolutely amazing right now. The breeze is blowing. I love it. I don't have any more chunky chains, so let's do the lower one instead. This is how she turned out. So cute. I like it. Something different. And since I just started making these, I can definitely be experimenting more with these. So super excited to see what I can do next. And I love the long chain on it. So cute. I'm definitely going to be buying more vinyls to make more of these. So stay tuned for that. And this is heavy. Thank you guys so so much for watching this video and hopefully I'll see you guys by the next one. Bye bye. Wait, the sun is coming out. Look at it. Gorgeous. See it from the back. Oh, there's some resin up top. You can see that. But definitely gonna need to be clean off. Cute. Ooh, the breeze feels amazing.